you know, I'm trying to think of a reason why I ski, but to me, it's kind of like been the opposite. I've never ever considered anything else. It's just kind of like been the only option of my whole life. It was not a matter of if I was going to be the best. It was just like, oh, when I go old, I'm going to be the best skier in the world. I think the actual first fragment of skiing I remember is the day I managed to go up the lift by myself on cross-country skis. My dad had told me that if I could do that by myself, he would buy me a real set of alpine racing skis. I remember that I really loved the whole thing about competing and, and the first race I went to, I got third and, and I didn't get a trophy and I was so pissed that I kept crying the whole evening. That competitiveness combined with you know us skiing a lot as kids led me into that path and I still hate losing to this day as more than anything. For me, I guess it doesn't really matter if it's one meter of fresh snow or a perfectly groomed icy slope. Just being able to go down a mountain and just think two seconds ahead is what I love the most about skiing. Like it really pushes all other, you know, stupid problems out of the way and you just live in the now, exactly where you are. I guess the biggest change was, you know, being a strict ski racer in Sweden, going to a ski academy. To them one morning wake up and, and check out the TV to see these guys skiing backwards, it was a big decision for me. But when I saw those guys spinning in the air, landing backwards, then, you know, that decision wasn't really a decision. It, it's what I wanted to do. You know, I, I realized that if I wanted to keep, keep being competitive, then I needed something else. So that's when I sort of started looking towards doubles. I think the most difficult part about the double flips was mentally telling yourself that it's possible. People would be chasing me rather than, you know, me chasing them. I think if I didn't have skiing, I don't know where I'd be. Because I mean, I look at one month in the summer and how I live my life during that month. I mean, it's constant parties and mayhem. And I think if I didn't have skiing to level my life out, it, it'd be chaos.